Hello everyone and welcome back to my YouTube channel. Today I will show you how to do digitization of roads in urban areas using MapFlow plugin in the QGIS environment. For this purpose, first of all, I need to provide some information regarding this plugin. I have already installed this plugin. If you don't have it, it's easy to do this. From plugins in QGIS environment, map and install plugins, abort fetching, then you will go to the search, look for map flow. As you can see, I have installed it already for this purpose. I don't have the option of install plugin, but you can you will have this here you install plugin. Here we have a brief information regarding this plugin that we can use it for building digitization, roads, fields, forests, and etc. Here I'm gonna target roads and we will continue how it's working. Okay, let's back here. I open plugin. For the first time that you want to use this one, you need to log in into the plugin. For this purpose, I have a video in my channel regarding the registration for this plugin. It's an easy process that you can follow and you can do it by yourself. Okay, right now, for this purpose, I'm going to add a OpenStreetMap to my QGIS environment. For this purpose, you can use browser XYZ tile and cl double click on OpenStreetMap. Very good. As you can see, it's added successfully. Right now, I need to find the targeted area that have roads. I'm going to apply this plugin in part of Rome city, very good. That I have different types of road. For the first step, I need to define a study area. And from new shape file layer, I can do this. Give it a name. Do not change file encoding, however, you can change geometry type. I'm, I'm going to use polygon and I will leave the other in default. Click on OK. Here we can see it's added as a layer, my layers. Right now, in order to define my study area, I can use toggle editing. Click on that. And this option is going to be available for you at Polygon. For this purpose, I click on Add Polygon feature. And from a word that I see as a suitable place, I can start to define my polygon. For example, here. Okay, very good. In a case of finishing, you can easily right click and it's finished. Here you can add an ID if you are interested, otherwise click on OK and finish. In order to do some modification on your polygon, you can right click on the polygon that you cre created from sing, single simple single symbol you can click on simple file try to use symbol layer type and here i prefer to have the outline of my layer instead of feeding layer here we can change the color if you are interested very good and that's it I'm going to a little increase the width 
and click on apply okay very good right now everything is ready to apply map flow plugin right now i'm gonna back to my map flow plugin in the first step i need to name the project that i'm going to do as i said i'm going to digitize road as the area i define my study area that i created before from data source i'm using mapbox satellite if you have image research imagery data you can choose here but this is the usual one that i'm going to use here ai model as i said before this plugin is available for digitizing roads buildings construction sites forests and trees here i'm going to use for roads okay very good in the next step i can click on start processing And so here, pay attention that your logit information should be here. Otherwise, you cannot start processing. As you can see, I have the information here. As you can see, I, I, oh, I'm signing in to my account. And you can start processing. Click on that. It's saying that we will notify you when the processing has finished. I'm saying okay, no problem. I have to wait. Since the study area is a little large, it's going to take a while for this process. However, we have a finished process. It's saying that double click in the table to download the result. I have to double click here. Pay attention. Double click here and click on road. Double click on road. As you can see, it's added to my layers. Right now, I don't need this one. I'm going to back to my QGIS screen. We select open a street map and a study area from road we can see that different types of road we have here from properties we can understand this one we can see that it's digitized roads based on the open street map here of course that they have not covered all part of the roads as you can see for example this edge this edge and also here we have an uncovered area that's covered building however until now i think it's okay we can use it for some processing and so geospatial analysis okay very good i hope the content of this video will be useful for you if you like these types of video please like the video and also subscribe to my channel thank you very much for your attention